Back in the taiga. There's a mission where we have to rebuild a bridge. Let's go check it out. What's up, guys and gals, and welcome back to this thing we call The Outer Middle Show. Mad Vlad is the name, and The Hunter. Call of the Wild is the game. And in today's episode, that's right, we're still hunting the missions. Continuing on with this glorious series. Been one of my favorites so far. It's been a tough one, but it's been fun. Now, in today's episode, let's go ahead and look at our missions. Not that one. This one. Elena points out a bridge. The Nanette used to safely cross reindeer over the frozen river when there's a thaw. It's broken now, though. Fixing the bridge should be an easy task for a survivor like you. Like me? Oh, look at that face. Oh, I'm gonna stuff those cheeks full of dick. <laughs> that, that was crude. I really shouldn't have said that. Anyway, look. Let's track this mission. Let's go ahead and hit track. Let's look at our map. See where this bridge is. Aha! Damn. It is way the fuck up here. So... We're going to have to go to this point. Let's go ahead and fast travel like Goku. Instant transmission, bro. <laughs> Let's go ahead and order us up an ATV. Because I, I don't want to walk, bro. If you got an ATV, why the, why the fuck would you walk anyway? Let's go to garage. Come on, go to garage. Let's get the red bitch. Yes! And here it is. What happened to that one four-wheeler that was here? Bigfoot took it. Bigfoot's real. I'm telling you, as I'm telling you right now, as this series progresses, you're gonna see, you're gonna see that that old man, fuck Gorgory or whatever his name was, was covering up Bigfoot. He got paid off. I'm telling you, I'm, I know these things. All right, I've met Bigfoot. He is a shyster, but goddamn, is he smart? Okay, let's mark this spot on our map. Place waypoint right there. All right, now let's go on a little adventure with our ATV in first-person mode. All right. This thing's a little weird to handle. I noticed, too, that the audio in the game was a little low, but whatever. I don't care. I don't want to take a shortcut this time. I actually want to take a path, man. This four-wheeler, even though it's a four-wheeler, sucks a lot of dick. Here's the path right here. Here we go. Ah, oh, feel the nice ice-cold air in your jeans as your wiener shrivels up to a willy worm. Look at the scenery. I need to get a four-wheeler. I think if I get a camera, a nice camera for outside and some cool cinematic shots, I may get on an ATV and just ride it through the forest. There is a spot that my family owns that's way in Daniel Boone National Forest, and I would love to showcase it, man. It is insanely beautiful in the springtime. All right, so we're gonna go on this path. As a matter of fact, we're pretty much almost there. I can't wait to kill something. I've been hankering. I fell asleep last night. I had a dream of slaughtering animals. It was beautiful. All right, coming up on the bridge now. Here it. Oh, oh, oh! See, we provide you with the logs and everything. Easy task for a survivor like you to fix them. Oh, so what are you trying to do? You're just calling me tough, so that way I'd do it. <laughs> I know your schemes, bitch. I'm not stupid. I'm not stupid in the ways of a woman's mind. That's not broken, it's just half built. You pansy bitch. Watch this. Oh! In the click of a button. You're a better hunter than a carpenter, I think. But you get high marks for spirit. How is that? Bitch, fuck People you. People like meaningless rewards. <laughs> that is why I'm always playing mobile games. Because you're a loser. <laughs> it's easy. Don't play mobile, alright? Play PC. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, now what? Let's check our missions. She's probably gonna spat off something here in a second anyway. Before you leave, the dicky coast. Before you leave the dicky coast for the lake, do me a favor and harvest some meat for the nanets. Okay. Any animal, your choice, except for reindeer. The reindeer herders have enough reindeer. What? Okay, harvest. So you mean kill? What do you want me to do? Call Santa Claus and fucking wrangle up a big flock of magic. Jingle Bell Deers? I don't know. Let's, let's look at the map. Let's see the area she wants me to harvest something. Okay. So you, you literally just want me to kill something. Is that is that what you want? Look. Oh, okay. There's Dicky Coast. Dicky. <laughs> all right. Well, uh, we can take this road all the way there. That's quite a long ride, but you know what? I think we can handle it. 
Let's go ahead and set that waypoint right in the middle. All right, let's get back on the road. Let's cross this fucking bridge. Get on your fucking ATV. And let's go kill something. All right, let's test this bridge out. A better fucking hunter than a carpenter. Bitch, I can do it all just as good. I'm the jack of all trades and the master of all. Going through the forest. Driving an ATV. Yeah, going through the forest. Yeah! Driving through the snow, kicking up rocks. I got my gun on my lap and a big dick in my pants. I'm gonna sling it out if I see Santa Claus's asshole. Yeah. Okay, that's enough. I'll see you when we get there. All right, we've made it. Dope. Now, I I'm guessing we have to kill something in this area if I haven't already scared it off. Cause this this ATV's loud, bro. It clears a whole area. Let's go up to the top. Let's take this tower and then let's. Finger some animals with our gun bullets. Oh, how I feel sorry for all those cuddly creatures. Every time I climb one of these, dude, I really get the willies. I don't know if you guys knew this, but I am terrified of heights. And it's even hard in a video game to come up high like this. Oh, I hate it. All right, let's survey the land. Yeah, very beautiful. I would so totally just whack off up here just at the sight of Mother Nature. Sometimes Mother Nature can turn you on with its beauty. Or with her beauty, I should say. All right, let me double check the map real quick. Let me make sure there's not a specific area she wants us to hunt. We're in Dinky Coast. All right, we've opened up the whole area. We've got a bunch of question marks. We've got a house up here. Okay, we still don't have any callers. We're getting really close. We need to be about level 15 before we can unlock quite a few of them. So we're still just going to have to play this by ear. What I mean by that is we're going to have to listen. Put our ears to the ground like an Indian hunting for buffalo. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. Let's go ahead and mark the road. And we'll just make our way up the road. I said road twice. I feel like an idiot. But let me pull out my whippy on. I got a new scope for this thing as well. You guys probably saw it at the end of the last episode. But looks good. I think I had this on that big 330 on my last save. I can't remember. I, I do believe it was this one. But it's much more clear. It's got a much bigger view range. And the sights, the sights are good. All right, they're good. So shut up. Let's frolic down this hill. I'm going to go ahead and auto walk. Just take my time. Not scare anything. And I'll let you know if I see something. Okay. Center mass shot. Maybe in the face. Okay. Hit her twice, baby. Yeah! Down. Hit her again. Alright, that motherfucker's as good as dead. Has to be. Always shooting center mass from now on. I'm not trying to go for those fucking heart shots or those front shots. Alright, see what I mean? Two non-vital shots, but they were pretty consecutive. Alright, and then I got another shot. When it took off like a bat out of hell. Okay, I hit it with the third shot up here somewhere. There it is. Okay, another non-vital hit. I don't, I don't understand how I'm missing all of his fucking organs. It's a moose! You fucking shitting me, dude. Three shots. Three. Count them. And it's still at 75% health. I'm really about to stop using this gun and just use a bow and arrow and a shotgun. But I'm going to try to track this fucking thing. All right, cool. It's losing health. Thank God. It's 50 to 75% right now. <laughs> The fuck? Oh, 25 to 50% health. Oh, it's hurting. It's hurting for a squirting. That, that was kind of gay. All right, it's dead somewhere up here. It's got to be. Where yet? There you are. <laughs> yes. I seen this butthole. Fucking dope. Let's collect this bitch. Look at that. Stomach shot. Flesh. And flesh. Seriously, take a DNA test. You must have Nanette's blood. How else could you get along so well out here? I'm this a pimp. make a fine meal for the gracious reindeer herders. They won't mind you hunting around their herds now. If you were next to me, I would toast to your hunting. Oh, you know what I'd do if you were next to me? <laughs> oh, I'd toast you, all right. I'd toast you in a tubular fashion. All right, what's next? Pounding out these missions like pound cakes. Time for you to move south along the Dickey Coast towards Bolshoi Lake Tiger. Okay. Closer to the Nana's migration route. 
Ooh. There's a campsite in the area that is well established. Check your hunter mate for more info. <sighs> Don't ever do that. All right, let's check our mission logs. She's wanting us to go south. When in Nenet's country, you must spot a reindeer before shooting it. Otherwise, you won't know if it's wild or Nenet's. Shooting the Nenet's reindeer is a good way to get yourself sacked, as in get fired. By now, I trust you're smarter than that, though. <laughs> you already know this. Looks like I'm going to have to use my binoculars to spot out Nanit's reindeers. You know, I think Nanit is Santa Claus. Let's just get that out of the way. Let's state the obvious here, all right? Nanit is fucking Santa Claus. Why else would he be wrangling reindeers, bro? That's where we are. This is the North Pole, where Bigfoot lives and, and a lot of other cool shit. Elves and shit. Let's look at our map. How far south you want me to go? Well, that's not too bad. I've already actually been here, bro. Uh, I'm gonna go back up here, get my four-wheeler, and then we'll... Well, you know what? I walk, man. Fuck it. It's not that far away. All right, here we are. In the area. Let's wait for this bitch to say something. Come on, say something. Say something! Huh? Okay, maybe we needed to be up here at this house, so... Let's see what happens. The proper Jalot. Not a bad hike. You have the legs of an Olympic marathon runner. I had a four Maybe not a gold medalist, maybe not silver, but bronze at least. And that is still something. Shut the fuck up. Why are you trying to belittle me all the time? Alright? You're not gonna say that when I jam this fucking tube stake in that hole. Okay. Let's go ahead and claim the spot. The nanites usually won't appeal to you directly for help, but I've given your mobile number to my sister, Katerina. Yes, nanites use mobile phones. If she asks for anything, please help her. We need the Nenet support to continue this expedition. I'll help her, all right. In that spirit, here is your next epic quest. Like I said, I'm gonna this fuck area sisters. is along a popular route for the Reindeer Herders Festival. But last year, for the first time, the Nenets had major problems with lynxes and brown bears here. Okay. The warmer springs led to a surge of vegetation, which led to a surge in small game, and that led to a big increase in large game. All sounds so? beneficial, right? Yeah. Except the region can't sustain that growth. The land is overgrazed. The rivers don't have enough fish anymore. That means more hungry lynxes and bears wandering off to places where they don't belong. And that means more attacks on reindeer. You are going to look into this problem. Oh, great. What am I hunting? What am I hunting? Come on, just just tell me. Let's go to our mission logs, God damn it! Oh my god, another photograph mission, man! Come on! Son of a bitch. So, I'm taking pictures of reindeers. All right, I'm going to do like I did the last picture mission. Okay? I'm just going to go ahead and cut to the chase. I hate this. Get started. First, you need to learn to spot the Nenet's reindeer so you don't accidentally harvest one. You'll need to track a reindeer and spot it with your binoculars. Go ahead. Start scouting for tracks. Shut up. I know what I'm doing, all right? I, I missed... A portion of that dialogue. I apologize. But you get the point, alright? She wants me to spot these reindeer to make sure that they're not Santa Clauses. Identify them. I don't know. Take pictures of them. There's a reindeer way out there. Gotta get in front of this tree line, bro. There we go. That's not a Nanet's reindeer. It's a free one. Hunt at your own discretion. But you must still find a Nanet's reindeer for me. <sighs> Fuck it. Alright. Ugh, fuck that shot up. I want to be able to hit it dead on, and it runs. For no fucking reason, it runs. There's no way it saw me. Come on, I wasn't moving. God damn it. Fuck it, we didn't need to kill it anyway. Oh, <gasps> more. Holy shit, they're everywhere. Oh, look at this. That is a reindeer from a nanet's herd. Okay. Do not shoot. Gotcha. Unless you're shooting a photo, of course. Shut your mouth. God, I wish they had grenades in this game. I think I could pitch one that far. God damn, how close do I gotta get for a fucking photo? Those are Santa's reindeers, bro. They're magical. Watch them take off flying. Yes! Thank you. This <gasps> is going to be my new desktop wallpaper. Yeah, Perhaps whatever, your bitch. most important mission yet. That was terrible. I want to shoot them so bad. I don't know why they're freaking out. I'm not moving. Now that you're acquainted with the reindeer population, let's talk predators. 
the lynx is a much bigger threat to the reindeer herds than the bears, so we'll need to check on the local population. Find and track a lynx south of the large permafrost crater. See your hunter mate for more details. Please. We need to determine if the lynx is eating a diet of reindeer. So we get to kill it. Okay, good, good, good. Thank God. Okay, so I guess that that means let's go ahead and let's look at our mission logs. We need to shoot a lynx in his mouth and open up his stomach. <laughs> All right. Look at the map. God damn. All right, so let's travel south. Let's look for a lynx. And this will be the last mission we play in this episode. I'll see you when we get there. Huh? <sighs> now we have to get a lynx. And I wish I was high enough level. Level 12. Let's see if there's a, a house in this area. There is a lookout. Yeah, fuck it. We're just gonna have to be super sneaky, bro. Find ourselves a lynx. Shoot him in his ass. Open up his stomach. See if there's any reindeer dicks in there. <gasps> oh my god. That's an albino fucking bear. I just found a fucking albino bear. Okay, that's not the albino. Let's just relax. There's a fucking albino bear right down here. This is the first albino animal I've ever found. There it is. Okay, two shots. I got a headshot. You're not getting away from me. You are not getting away from me, buddy. Reload. All four shots. Come on, baby. Please don't get away from me. I don't give a fuck about that lynx right now. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Calm down. Catch your fucking breath, bro. Catch it. Catch your breath. Fuck it. I think I shot it enough to kill it. That's an albino bear. Okay. First shot. Non-vital hit. Still at 75% to 100, and then I shot it again way out here. Oh my god, we're gonna get an albino bear. Shot it again way out here. There it is. That's a vital hit, baby. Okay, it's 50 to 75%. It's gonna bleed like crazy, especially with those multiple shots. 50 to 75, 25 to 50. Oh, it's almost there. That's gotta be an albino bear. That's the whitest goddamn bear I've ever seen. Come on, it's gotta be right up here. It's got to be right up here. I also upgraded some of my skill points so that I can better track. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. It fucking did a little L-shaped looperino here, and there it is! Yes! Let's, let's get a look at this thing. That's a polar bear, bro. Oh man, it's all up in the brush. That's an albino. It's got to be. Either that or I'm stupid. I might just be stupid. All right, let's see what this is. Where's the fur type? Blonde? That's albino, man! Come on. Give me a break. Poop dicks. Well, I thought it was albino. It says blonde. I don't know if... I don't know... Whoa. 270 polymer tip bullets. Yes! We've unlocked those. Good. First shot was right in his neck. Second shot was stomach. Third shot was his pelvis. I don't know how the fuck I shot him in the pelvis from the front. That's weird. And fourth shot was directly in his asshole. Look at his position there. He's like, poor bastard. All right, I'll accept. Damn it, I really thought I found something special. I hear more bears out here. You can hear bears walking around from a long ways away. All right, I kind of got distracted by that. Let's hunt some lynx. Holy Toledo tits. All right, we are back. And I am better armed and shit. All right, I level up enough to where I could get a shotgun, which I am grasping at this very moment. I've got buckshot, not the shitty bird shot. I've actually got... Wait a minute, that's not it. What, what the fuck? Where is it? I've got a predator collar. A distress signal, so to speak. And I've also got a boar collar. Let's, let's listen to this. Okay, so I call in boars. Let's use the predator distress signal to call in a lynx. It's very weak. Let's get out here on the water. Everything is upwind of us, so we are in a very extremely shitty spot. Let's get down on the ice. Let's call us in Lynx. 
shoot it and it fucking head and open up its belly. Now I have to be extremely patient when using this collar. I've used collars like this before in the past and I wasn't patient. And it seemed like every single time I got bored and tried to move, there was an animal right next to me, literally. So, if I'm out on the ice, hopefully laying down, I'll be able to spot one of those cocksuckers. <sighs> give them a taste of some good old-fashioned American lead. That is if I'm American. <laughs> Alright. Laying down, we're going to do some calls. And I'll let you know if one runs up. Okay, we successfully called in a lynx. That was blind luck. Now let's blow its fucking guts out. <laughs> yes! Yes, head, shoulders, knees, and toes. I just got an achievement. That was dope. Is that another one? No. Okay. Dude, that collar works. I've only been out here for like maybe three minutes. And I've just been constantly using that collar. And one just walked right the fuck up on me. Yes! That was dope. I stayed out in a nice, big, wide open area. And I one-shotted a lynx. The lynx is a cunning animal that almost never attacks humans. They are quiet, they are cautious, and Ooh. they are fast. I have seen some here up to 40 kilograms. No joke. This is an apex predator. As rare as it is deadly. Yeah, and look bad. at that. This lynx still has a belly full of reindeer. The nanites will be relieved to know that this animal is no longer dining on their herds. And let's be real. Harvesting a lynx is no small feat. To hunt the apex predators, one must be an apex hunter. And you certainly are. Yes, I am! It had a belly full of reindeer dicks, boy. Yes! All right. That was a very clean and exciting episode. Now that we have collars, we have the upper hand. And we'll be able to hunt more effectively throughout the rest of the episodes. It's going to be dope. I wonder what she has in store for us next. Let's take a look. So, would you do a personal favor for me? Sure, I'll eat your ass. I've marked the map on your hunter, mate. Go there. When I was a girl, this was my favorite place to pray to my ancestors. Uh. I know it's superstitious, but could you... Could you say a prayer there? Pray to anyone you want. Pray to no one. Your choice. Just s something about finding reindeer in that lynx. It unsettles me. Okay. The air is getting colder. And I'll pray. I, I think we could use a little divine help. Divine help. I am your divine help, bitch. You're not giving me the credit I deserve, all right? I'm not a god by any means, but god damn it, I am the hunter. And I will slay the tiger one episode at a time. All right. That does it for this episode. You heard what she said. The next episode, we're going to find a place and say a prayer. We're going to pray to the gods of spaghetti or something. I don't know, but it's going to be dope. Big shout out to the sponsor, Space Jam. Their links are down in the description, including their free giveaways. Go check them out. I love you guys. And a friendly word of advice. <laughs> if you want... <coughs> if you want a herd of reindeer and a couple go missing, just remember... It's probably not a lynx. It's probably Bigfoot. Pimping out the reindeer and throwing them on the corner for a cheap buck. Because they're... <laughs> because they have the softest assholes in all of the land. And they smell like sugar cookies. <laughs> God damn it, man. Look. Just don't forget that. Hit the like button, subscribe, and leave a comment. Flick the ding dong so you will know when Mad Vlad uploads a video. Support Vlad on Patreon. Thumb his butthole. If you thumb his butthole for twenty dollars, you get to be his videos. Join his Discord. Follow him on Twitch. Follow him everywhere so he can finger your belly button and make you pee. Space jam is juice from the gods. Look down there and push lots of buttons. Man army for life. We are all virgins. I have no neck. Goodbye.